What's up, guys? So you'll never guess what I get to do again today. Wait. You saw the title. I quit. I quit. I can't do it anymore. Anyways, guys, we're going back to the old prison to do some more cleanup. It's the 19th of May right now, and like I said, it's more cleanup days. Let's get started. Uh, banquet hall. I'll, I'll give you, a, as we walk there, I'll tell you a little bit. This building we refer to as the spa building. Uh, it's obviously the, the entryway to the building. There's supposedly a spy in there. I don't know why they call it. This is the admin building. Um, obviously, this is where all the intake was made, administration. Down this, the long building down there is called East Block. Those are the actual main housing unit for East Block. West Block is that down there. So this has all been somewhat cleaned up. It was a lot worse. There was debris everywhere when we first got in here, but they, we've somewhat cleaned this up. This is one of the buildings I'll be working on more today. Just a real quick brief tour around here. This is the dining hall and gymnasium over there. Um, this building straight ahead of us with the two spires on top, that is the north segregation unit. That's where uh, prisoners that were not behaving were housed. Smokestack, that is the powerhouse that powered the facility. The green spire is the church. To the left of the church is a school. Um, the double story right behind the green spire on the church. The top story is the library. The bottom story is the laundry. Um, and we'll. All these people out here, uh, they're part of a uh, metal detecting club. They're finding, hopefully, collectibles that they can find, shanks. And we have found already a lot of shanks and stuff in a lot of the buildings. As tearing out drywall, we found cigarettes that were hidden in drywall and stuff. Um, there's also a group that has a contract with the city that plays um, airsoft here. So there are some airsoft players here. I don't know if they're going to be playing while we're here around or not. So I'll try to describe a few more things as we walk here. Um, this is where a lot of the activities will be held once we first get this open in June, July, August, as far as hopefully, you know, some opening ceremonies and stuff will be held out here in the main courtyard. Okay. Um, so this building here was the last one that was destroyed by the fire a couple of years ago, I believe, is that one right there. Um, unfortunately, there were a lot of records in there that we lost. Um, this long two-story building back there, that's called the honor unit. That's uh, where prisoners that were a little more well-behaved, they were just housed in there in bunks. Uh, we cleaned that whole thing up about two weeks ago. That's pretty much gutted inside. This is uh, the fire department. Um, there's a lot of hazardous chemicals still in there and stuff that we gotta get to at some point, but that's the fire department. Oh, uh, while we're here, I'll tell you. Um, so, Blues Brothers, that's Blues Brothers. So that is the gate that Jim Belushi exits from. John Belushi, who's the one that, John Belushi. Yeah. John. John. That's the one that he exits from with the lights behind him. Uh, at the beginning of the movie also, that's where you remember the guard slides a little thing and says yes, and they come in, that's that gate back there, and the little sliding door is still there. So, the, so again, this one is uh, on the bottom is the laundry, the top floor is the library. This building and this building are two of the ones that are in the best shape. I mean, there was a lot of stuff in there, but structurally they're pretty sound and everything. So these are the ones we've really been working on cleaning that'll be available hopefully for the first tours. Um, this one here is, is so structurally sound and for the most part in good shape. We've stored a lot of the collectible stuff like furniture and stuff that will be used eventually. So we got to go through here to get to our building. But this, all this stuff was moved in here. It's all collectible. This is where they had a lot of tools and they did a lot of work in here as well. Um, so you'll be able to see in some of them, uh, there's places where they got the tools that were hung up. And this is, uh, I think they worked on carpentry in here and plumbing. This will be used as some sort of banquet facility as well. They've already somewhat cleaned this. All these are pews out of the chapel. A lot of this other stuff was moved in here. So this has already been pretty much rough clean. So we're gonna go upstairs to the top floor, which will be a banquet facility as well, which has not been touched at all. And so you'll see kind of the shape that the buildings were in. The only, uh, only difference up there is it doesn't get quite as much water damage as a lot of them. So we'll go up there. Uh, these steps are fairly sound, be careful. I'm dying. So we've been working on this upstairs area for a while now, and we got a lot done. It's way more clean than it was when we came up here originally. I'm still working on it. I'm sweeping up and I'm moving stuff. So, so yeah, everything's coming out great. Apparently, this is like an area where they like sell some of the stuff, and you know, there's hella files up here. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah. So I'll videotape some more in a little bit. We clear out here, Dan? 
Oh, we are. Nice. The mayor's out there, so. I was just playing air sauce. <laughs> Just, just watch your steps. That was like one, two. The two floors. floors? Two floors right there. I wouldn't walk too much. I'm really bad. That's crazy. I wonder what they're gonna do with that. Probably just gonna take out everything out. Actually, it looks like. It. Yeah, maybe. So. Well, this is a pretty cool piece. It says. Uh, uh, never too late to mend. Yeah, never late to mend. That's awesome. Duck work out. Make it. Can probably come back here with. It. That's awesome. Some uh, sandblasting. You gonna repaint the walls or, or just to leave extent, it? Yeah, and kind of. Some of it will, will, will be, but. We're on the second floor. The second floor. Well, this is a pretty cool room for area. What is that mural? It's, a, it's a, mu a mural of something. I'm not sure exactly what, but it's original. Unfortunately, I'm not sure how much we're, we'll be able to say. So right now, I'm in the warden's office. Got some music playing right now. They took out all the windows and stuff, so like, oh, there is bars. Yeah, let me, there we go. Now you can see it. There's bars up there. It's a whole view of the entire prison. It's beautiful. It really is. Oh, this place is pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. This bathroom's back here. Let's check this out. Let's see the bathroom. It's one toilet. Okay. Interesting. What's this way? Oh. I didn't even. Okay. So it's May 20th and we're out here again, working on it. It's a different day, so different stuff. It's actually colder outside today, but whatever. Um, they had me outside in the yard cleaning up some of the rocks and stuff like that that were around. And they needed my help inside, so I came inside, um, carrying some of the stuff down still. And um, yeah, they tore some of the carpet. So like this is like the original hardwood floor. It has a nice design around the corners of it. So uh, yeah, day two. Thank <laughs> you.